Hello friends, I am Madhura. Welcome to madhuradrecipe.com. Today I am making Rajma Masala. It's one of favorite in our family. So over here I have cooked this Rajma over medium heat for 7 whistles. Do not uh, pressure cook your Rajma on high heat. Always cook it on medium heat so that it cooks out evenly. Now let's check this out. Wow. Looks so good. You can see that. It has cooked really good. And let's keep this aside. Our Rajma is getting cooked. In the meantime, we'll prepare some masala to make this Rajma masala. So in a blender jar, I'm adding one large onion that's been roughly chopped like this. Now uh, goes in three to four cloves of garlic and some ginger. Cover this up and we'll grind this to make this into smooth puree. Don't add water while blending this onion. Just uh, try to blend it at, as it is. We are not looking for a fine consistency of this uh, ground onion. And over here our this ground uh, onion paste is already. Look at the consistency. I have not added any uh, water while blending this up. Now we'll fry this ground onion masala. So over here I have heated 2 tablespoons of oil. In that goes in a teaspoon of jeera cumin seeds. Let them sizzle around. After this jeera sizzles goes in this ground onion masala. Now we're gonna saute these uh, onions for like uh, seven to eight minutes on a medium high heat, or until it gets light golden color or browning. All right. So over here I have sauteed this onion paste over medium high heat for around seven minutes now, and you can see that onion has changed its color and it has got nice golden color. We need to uh, remove all the uh, raw flour from this onions and we have to cook this till that point. Now in this goes in a uh, tomato puree. So I have used one medium sized uh, tomato to puree it down. Goes in all our dry spices, garam masala, red chilli powder, coriander powder and little bit of amchur powder. Give that a mix. And we'll cook this for another uh, 5 to 6 minutes or until uh, oil loses out from the spices. Over here I have cooked this masala over medium high heat for uh, 6 to 7 minutes now. And you can see that uh, this masala is very well cooked and oil has also started to separate out from the spices. Now at this point of time we'll go ahead and add in this cooked rajma in that color of masala or gravy looks fabulous now, if you are watching my uh, channel for the first time uh, you can subscribe also you can like and comment now after adding a rajma cooked rajma we'll add in some water just a little bit around half cup salt stir that in smells so good and you can see the consistency it's fabulous and it has got this awesome color as well now cover this up and let this rajma soak all the flares from this masala for around another five to six minutes over here i have cooked this covered for exactly five minutes on medium high heat wow it smells fantastic and look at the consistency color perfect now turn off the heat and garnish with some finely chopped coriander leaves it goes really well with uh, chawal or plain boiled rice rajma and chawal makes awesome combination as well as it goes perfect with some paratha or fulka or homemade chapati or roti 
I hope you liked my today's video. For uh, more such easy and delicious recipes, please visit my channel that is madhuratrecipe.com developing a new taste. See you soon. Bye bye.